Hello guys, and welcome to another wonderful Couch Talks. Um, today we wanted to talk about Animal Crossing Day 16. Day 16 of Animal Crossing. Um, spring has started. Yes. Um, we have some new residents. We've started some new projects. Mm-hmm. Um, and we have all the trees. Thanks to Ashley. Well, not all of them, but we have so yes, many trees. We actually do. Oh, have, do we? We have every fruit now. Uh, my stepsister came and dropped off all of the fruit that we did not already have in our town. Wow. I don't think all of it has grown in yet. Okay. I haven't seen the oranges grow in, but I definitely planted some. Okay. They're all along the coastline. All right. Well, so, yeah. massive shout out to Kitty's stepsister. Um... So tomorrow we should have a new bridge, stone yes. bridge. So we should share a map at some point, but we, I accidentally picked like the worst possible town layout because I didn't realize that we wouldn't have any bridges or ramps. So there's I can just the river splits and then like rejoins so that there's an island in the middle of the island and also the river runs through every single level twice. Yeah, I think it's fantastic. I think yeah. it shows great. Yeah, I just if I had realized that it would not be a regular Animal Crossing game where the community already existed before I arrived <laughs> then um I might have picked Something that needed less bridges, so we will need like at least four, I think. That's okay. Yeah. We, we want to upgrade one of the bridges we have as well, so we just have a simple wooden bridge, which is yeah. not terrible, but it does look, I would say, you know, if that's the it's vibe. It's gonna look terrible once we get all the stone bridges. In yeah, place. if you're going yeah. for like a woodsy vibe, keep it. If you're not, then we're gonna get rid of it. But anyway, um. Uh, also, something that Zill's super excited for is Queenie's back. Yes, Queenie was one of my villagers for a long time in Leaf, who I got her picture, and I'm excited that she's back. Cool. And, and we also got Leopold, who is a seems... massive nerd. Yeah, I talked to him, and it sounded like he was going to be some kind of like SoCal wannabe artist slash wannabe actor slash just a SoCal wannabe and he's not so far so that's great. Yeah he also just you go we went into his house and um, he set up like a school house mm-hmm. which is fine you know he's just kind of I'm wondering where the man sleeps. He's in a locker. <laughs> I guess <laughs> yeah. Um, also I'm not a huge fan of, of the Easter event the bunny day. Yes. Uh, at, on a personal level I just don't like it. Um, I just don't like Zipper. I don't, the I Zipper? I do not like Zipper. He looks like an FF character. A Final Fantasy character? No, a Five Nights at Freddy's character. Okay. I just think that uh, the eggs are obnoxious. Like, give me my normal fruits off my trees, yeah. please. And Oh, fishing is the worst. Because you, you can't, it just looks like a fish. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh gosh, I haven't experienced that yet. And that, like, that, it's one thing to like just spread hidden eggs in like random trees and like in the ground. That didn't bother me. But what bothers me is when you start replacing other resources. I don't know, I didn't like it. I'm yeah. not, not a fan, not digging it. I can't wait until it goes away. I'm sure there's lots of people out there, especially of the younger persuasion, that are totally digging it. I'm not. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> younger persuasion. They've been persuaded to be younger. Yep, yep. Um, uh, but yeah, spring has started, so I'm I'm digging the new, the new bugs. All the new bugs yes. are pretty fun. Yes. And and uh, I ha- hadn't actually gone into the tailor until today. I know I'm bad. We've had it for like six or seven days now, or longer. Um, and I just hadn't gone in. It's a cool little shop. Um, Zill knows more about it though. You want to talk about it? Yeah, I like how they've handled it. So now it still has pretty much all the old features, but there's also like long term items that are there. So there will be your normal like rotates every day and then the display area for people's designs. And then off to the side, there's two outfits that are just 
like basically there for the entire season, which I think is super cool. Um, also, I like the way that the dressing room works, where I can go and try out different various outfit piece combinations, come up with ridiculous outfits like my Viking shirt and skirt and flower and the pixel shades. Okay. That's the one you saw that you said was fantastically ridiculous. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think we said this in our last video, but relocating is expensive. Yes. Um, it's expensive. Yes. Yeah. Also, uh, our, one of our biggest projects right now is we're designing our own town square. So, mm -hmm. obviously, the, if you've played the game at all, you know that um, the Nooks have their own little town square they've set up and pre-established, kind of, and you can't really build on it. And you um, can't decorate it. And you can't decorate so it. Let me put furniture on it. Okay. Which makes sense because when certain things happen, they need to mess with that space. So it makes sense for the game to be like, cool, this space is designated to these cutscenes. Yeah. But I wanted to decorate one, so I built my own fountain and I bought a popcorn stand. And. And so we're, what our plan yeah. is is we're going to take pictures of it, and every single time we post a. A Animal Crossing video. We're going to try to remember to talk about it and share the progress of it. Um, I'm sure it'll be a fairly long project, so it should be a continuing thing. Mm -hmm. um, got to try out mul multiplayer, like true multiplayer, like online over a different two different switches the other day with my friend Kristen. Shout out to Kristen. Thanks for you know coming and visiting. Um, it seems really fun. It seems really cool. It, it's pretty much just like any most multiplayer experiences I've ever had. You can even ha send text to your friend that's in the game with you to uh, communicate if you don't have the app, and which yeah. allows you to use voice. Uh, the app yes. is on your phone. And like I've your real life phone, not the Nook phone. Yeah. <laughs> I've gotten, or sorry, I've not had the chance to actually use the voice because nobody else has been on it, but you can just connect it like, especially with a headset, you can just forget you're connected until someone hops in. Yeah. Don't have to monitor it. I don't think your phone even has to be unlocked or anything oh, like really? that. Oh, really? Okay. I haven't messed... But I'm not sure, because yeah. I haven't I, had a chance. Yeah, I haven't really messed with the app. We'll try to do that before yeah. our next video, so we know a little bit more about it. Also, if you want to text chat, the app is nice, because you use your phone keyboard. Yeah. But you can't use it to send letters. You can only use it for the chat. So... Just so you know, CJ, I'm still painstakingly writing out all of your letters Thanks. with the soft keyboard. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that's everything that's new and we wanted to talk about today. I'm not seeing anything else on our little list that we've compiled for ourselves. Um, there's a smiley face that uh, Zill drew for me. There's a smiley face on here. Yes. Um, so, serious talk. Uh, <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I feel like we're missing something though. I thought there was something. Was there anything else? Uh, I played with the turnip market. Mostly. Oh yeah. Okay. And how'd that go? I made 20k. Wow. Which is not that much. There are people who... So I found this subreddit, which I did not join because it seems like right now is a pretty terrible time to join it because it's being botted super hard. But um, basically, people post their buying and selling prices. I guess you can go to other towns to buy and sell. Okay. And people will straight up be like, yeah, I'll tip you a million because that's how much they're making. Wow. <laughs> okay. So, I guess for some easy money, go to that subreddit, whatever it is. Um, cool. Right, well, I think that's all we have for you then, guys, on Animal Crossing Day 16. Um, the stock market and it's springtime, I guess. Or something. Uh, again. And also zipper, get out of my town. And also zipper, please leave. Please <laughs> leave. Like I don't mind you as a character. Some do, but mostly just stop making everything eggs. I, I just don't. He doesn't look like the bunny villagers. Yeah. I I think that's what bothers me so much about him. There are bunny villagers, and he doesn't look like one of okay. them. Okay. Looks like somebody got in a bunny suit. And it's not okay in that game. It's like somebody getting in a human suit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. All right. <laughs> Again, massive, massive shout out to um, Ashley and Kristen. Thanks for, for Ashley helping us with all the trees and Kristen showing me how the online stuff works and helping me with that. Um, yeah. Anything else? No. Cool. 
Well, have a magical day, guys, and we will keep you updated as much as we can. Cheers. Also, we almost forgot, which is why you can't see me, but obligatory YouTube outro. Yes. Yeah, so like and subscribe and press all the buttons except the dislike, and also don't <laughs> press the minimize or the close button. <laughs> and don't or forget any of those other videos that aren't from us. Press <laughs> one of the other ones. And please share and. Uh, you know, if you, if this isn't your thing, that's fine. Share this with one of your friends who is this is their thing. Have a magical day, guys, again.